Welcome back family. So today in this video we're going to talk about bacterial bloom and what happened to me. Alright? Stay right there. Alright family, so welcome back. So today we're going to talk about bacterial bloom and this is more like a help me video if you say so what happened to family is um I had a fish last Thursday he wasn't doing too good I guess I guess he got beat up I'm not not quite sure what happened but he was swimming very irregularly and I said to myself he'll be all right you know so anyway that was about Thursday night went to my bed Friday morning I got up late for work didn't check the tank you know I was just Russian. Went to work, got home Friday night, checked my tank family, and he was dead. So, no big deal. But when I took him out, family, it was really, really stink. Got the, oh man, this might have spiked my um, ammonia. I checked my ammonia, of course, it was high. You know, I had an ammonia spike. So I said, okay, I did a water change. And family, I did about maybe a 35 to 40 percent water change and the next day boom my whole tank is cloudy now I know this is actually a bacterial bloom right but so far all the fish is doing good as you can see they're swimming they're coming up um, I have been using prime you know to try to keep the water as healthy as I can and but find that when you tell me how do you handle this situation? You know, when you guys to flood the comments, let me know. Some people say, I'm looking on YouTube, some people say they do um, like 10% water change a day. Some people say they leave it alone, they let the algae, you know what I mean, sorry, let the bacteria go away on, on its own. So I'm a little bit, you know, in between because I don't really know which side I should go with. <clears throat> but I mean, 10% water change a day, you know, couldn't really hurt, you know, it would actually help. But, you know, it's, it's really bad, <clears throat> and if you look on the glass, family, there's like some little, I guess, wiggly things, floaty things, you know, on the glass. But I know it's bacterial bloom. <clears throat> I didn't, o I did not overfeed. Um, my gravel is fully vacuumed. I vacuum my gravel like every other week. So I definitely know it's bacterial bloom from that dead fish. So I get it, probably just um. You know, let me know. I think I'm going to go with the 10% water change every day. You know, try to keep it, you know, light as well as, you know, fresh. And try to get rid of as much of this um, cloudy water as possible. All right, but like I said, family, definitely let me know what you do to, you know, handle this issue. If you ever had this issue before, you know, just let me know. Okay, fill out the comments, please. Again, just, have, just let me know. Look at my guys. They're all here. <laughs> Uh, I'm I'm real glad that everyone is actually fine. You know, I have no casualties. Everyone is good. All right, fine. But until then, man, you know, as always, be a blessing to someone. Don't block your blessing. And as always, peace out. God bless. All right?